Nauki Jaba was born 756 years after the foundation of Etrand, being born as the oldest legitimate son of Krolba Jaba, who at the time was already ruling a highly influential criminal empire. Wanting his son to be able to put a more civilized face on the crime syndicate, while his father Krolba came from a humble background and never gained any proper education, relying on his street smarts when building his empire, Nauki was surrounded by the best tutors drug money could afford, both Pepe Toka and foreigner alike. It was through this interaction with his foreign, specifically Western, tutors that Nauki gained a keen interest in Occidental lore as well magic. One of his tutors was secretly Ashram Wegnard, with whom the future crime boss formed quite the bond. A life of crime is never easy, even for ones born into power and privilege. Assassination attempts on both himself and his close relatives, especially his father. Business deals going awry, former allies turning into backstabbers, etc., all served as acute reminders to Nauki of his own mortality, but those are not the kind of mortality Nauki would grow most fearful and disgusted of. Instead, he developed an irrational fear of aging, of growing old. He developed a fascination with blood magic, using it as a way of unnaturally extending his lifespan and partially reversing his aging. He also developed disturbing fetishes, possibly as a way to compensate for his fear of aging. 804 years after the foundation of Itran, Nauki's father Krolba died. After a brief succession crisis, Nauki came out as the winner, as the new head of the Jabba crime empire. However, he inherited an empire in steady decline, an empire struggling to regain its former glory. Nauki rules over an empire in decline, but an empire nonetheless. The Jabba criminal empire might be under gradual decline under Nauki's decadent rule. It is still powerful and influential enough to be a credible threat to the existence of anyone who is foolish enough to paint a crosshair on their own back. Among his allies, he counts Kurkassian and the Zmogars.